Hello. Hello, Katya. Hello, Katya. Hello, hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. How about are, you? I'm okay, thank you. Are you working now? Are you Are you back to no, work? No, no. Not right now. Okay. All right, there's Alex. There's more people coming in now. Good evening. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, T-shirt. Hi, Katya. Hi, Alex. How was your Wednesday? It's a long week. This week was long, no? Yes, uh, middle week. The middle of the week, yes. Um, do you have vacation next week? Yes, only, only rest work today for my vacation. <laughs> But um, the uh, legal two days is Thursday and Friday, right? Yes, I finished this Friday. Okay. I don't have a vacation, teacher. You don't? No, I don't because I, ha I have the vacation in Ju June. At the bank. Oh, okay. What is that painting behind you? Katia. He's my nephew. I give to my boss, uh, to my nephew because <laughs> he wants to draw and paint all the walls in the house. Mm -hmm. I give my wall. <laughs> oh, okay, good. He was happy. Painting and drawing, my. Hey, that's Adisa. a good idea. I think every little kid gets happy painting on a wall. Yes, I like my wall. <laughs> All right, cool. Hello, Milton. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Fine, thank you. And you? I'm good. How are you? How is everything? Uh, this day was very, very quiet. Uh, my my job is nothing interesting. Normally, normally I say it's a normal job. Yes. All right. Good. You uh, teacher, do you do you saw the the play yesterday? The game yesterday? 
The no, I didn't. A Barcelona Juventus. Yeah, I didn't, but I, I heard it was good. Yeah, see, it, it, it was interesting. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay, interesting. Hold on. What was the score? Two, two for two is good. Two. Uh, two. To Barcelona, to Juventus, to goal, goal is, is good in English, goal. Teacher? To what goals? Goal, to goal, Barcelona, to goal, Juventus. Yes, it was 2-2. Two, two. Yes, e, empate in, in English. Tie. Tie, okay. The, the game, uh, M tie. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, the, yeah, that's what I saw. That's what I kind of saw that the game was tie. All right. And Alex, what's up? Sit down. Yes, what's teacher. Up? Okay. Yes. Everything cool? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Okay. So let's start. Let's start. Let me see. Let me share my screen with you. Okay, do you see the lady? Yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, let's listen to her now. Can you solve problems? Can you find solutions? Nice. Now, let's learn the following vocabulary. Verbs. Analyze. Find. Organize. Explore. Make. Solve. Nouns. A mistake. A situation. Alternatives. Information. A problem. A solution. Possibilities. Let's discuss some questions, then ask your partner. Don't forget to use the new vocabulary. When you make decisions, do you explore all the possibilities first? Who do you talk to when you need to find a solution to an important problem? When was the last time you analyzed a mistake you made? What did you learn from it? Solve. Noun. Okay, first we have the verbs. We understand analyze, find, organize, <clears throat> explore, yes. make, and solve, right? That's no problem. Yes. Nouns, a mistake, yes. a problem, a situation, a solution, alternatives, information, or possibilities. Okay. Do you think it's Salvador? The selector has possibilities for <laughs> <laughs> for anything. Which which kind of selector, teacher? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we don't we don't have possibilities for nothing. They they, they don't have any possibilities. They, maybe maybe with the Loquilta FSC with the selector, maybe there's a possibility. Yes. <laughs> okay, a problem, a solution. Possible. Oh, this is easy. We understand that, correct? A mistake, a situation. For example, do you see what's going on in the United States in this moment that cada rato there's a shooting? Pa, 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 pa. Mm -hmm. What do you think the problem is? 
I think that the problem is uh, uh, the many gun store accessible to uh, all people. Okay. For me, the problem is the the guns is easier require uh, at the side adhere by the all the people is very easy yeah you know for me i don't think guns is the problem for me it's a mental problem yes because Be all people all people have a lot of stress or a lot of problem in in her life Mm, for t shirt, for, yes. uh, in, for me, in, no, it's the, it's the, it's, it, it, no, it's, it's the problem, the, the mental situation, <laughs> because uh, the same problem are, is in, in all the countries, but uh, only USA have a, uh, a, uh, is your acquisition for the guns? But now I think because when you when you uh, watch uh, um, magazine, mm -hmm. you can you watch the different problem in the people because. The people use guns um, has a lot of problem. But you know what? Like, I don't think guns is the problem. And I don't know why people concentrate in the United States. Oh, the problem is gun. If a man is going to go to a school and kill 40 children, really, I don't think the gun was his motivation. This man had some mental problems. Mental. I think he um, has nine. he has he has um he has to receive in when um, I how do you say um he has received bullying yes yeah because you know I I think that, I mean guns is a problem yes it's a problem but I don't think it's the problem because I think that if Okay, imagine, imagine if guns don't exist, these people will always be crazy. So next will be bombs or like she says homemade bombs. I don't know if you remember many, 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 many years ago, there was anthrax. Yes. And with letters. Yes, yeah. with letters. So there's always going to be, I think, I think that if they take guns now, that does that's that will not stop the problem. I think I think that do you know in 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 English there's an expression red flags. Well, do you know what is a red flag? The expression? No. 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 What does it mean? Okay. Um. Imagine. Sure. Yes. Yes, but but they uh, use uh, for use a. Um, uh except for the example or or, or similar uh, example for 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 duration of, okay uh, i my observation my, my observation is uh, they they are uh, access to the social media uh, games for guns and 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 for the for this reason they they uh, form uh, uh, ideas and yes they get ideas yeah for 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 your actions yes but you know but i don't i don't know in my opinion if you ask me i don't think i don't think that me looking at a gun store will inspire me to go kill 40 people I think I want to kill 40 people and I don't know how, which is the best way? Ah, oh, with a gun. But I don't want to comprar guns. Oh, okay, then I'll make a bomb. Or, or I will, 
but that will not stop me, you know. Yes. But, you know, no, like, but I remember another. I remember another oh. magazine when a policeman fight a black man. Mm -hmm. That is a mental problem because is black. What happened with the with the in in United States uh, has a different race. For example, white, uh, black, or Indian. Palestinian or different race. And mm -hmm. I think it's a mental problem because um, all people in the United States receive a lot of stress and a lot of bullying. When was uh, a child, people, a uh, child, um, yeah, when I, when they were people and receive uh but what is your example, point what, what do you what, but what are you saying that why only black people or what no because in the magazine i watch the policeman fight a black man because uh i don't remember but the black man uh, he bought in uh grocery store and the policemen believe in that black men Robert in the grocery store but it's not true yeah have you ever lived in the United States um no but I I have a family and yeah. my mother-in-law he okay. live in she live in the United States. Have you seen people in El Salvador that, let me give you an example. Let me give you an For example. For example, in our country, not a seat, this, this problem. Um, no, but let, let, me, let, 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 me, let me explain to you why maybe that problem exists. I'm not saying this is the correct answer, but let me explain why. Have you seen people here in El Salvador that um okay uh how can i explain this to you when you see the mothers of all these mareros they're saying oh my son is innocent oh my son he was working what do people say it's like yeah right or when you see the women crying oh mr president please my son is a good boy what do people yeah. say they are no, crazy. They are crazy. crazy. Okay. These people are very different from the majority of good people in El Salvador, right? Ni el propio salvadoreño les cree, correct? To this, to this yes. women. Yes. Okay. Yes. Listen to my word. Unfortunately, desgraciadamente, in the United States, Black people are similar and Latinos. The majority, I'm, I'm, I'm speaking in general, okay? So don't tell me, but my friend, his father is black and is a doctor. No, I'm, I'm generalizing. The majority of criminals in the United States or bad crimes, drug dealers, are black people or Latinos. Yes. I, I'm, I'm sorry to say that. And, well, I am Latino, you know, but... And that that's the problem it, over there you go into a bad neighborhood como aquí you go to el what el can el pepeto no como como es el la, como se llamaba la de la vida loca la, la campanera la campanera we're only going to see <laughs> bad people and but i imagine there are good people there too i imagine but if you generalize La Campanera is dangerous. It's similar in the United States. I like black people. They're very, very nice. But the majority, in the cases, at least in California, though, or son Latinos or they're black. And maybe that's why the police, maybe that's why they, they do that. Maybe. Um, because you know, in the United States, the government pays you. 
like if you're a single mother and you have one son and you can't work, the government will give you money. But why why do you think the government gives you money? Do you know why? Uh, to help people. To help you, yes. And I think I think that you should be a thank you government and look for a job, but no. What do you do? You get pregnant again and you have another kid and you have another kid. The more children you have, the more money you receive and you don't work. <laughs> really? So it comes to a point that you are paying taxes. Well, por lo menos in the United States. Por eso si ustedes ven, irónicamente, eh, Donald Trump ganó mucho donde hay latinos. So imagine, oh. imagine, and this is why, because imagine, Sara, you are, you live in California because in the United States, depending, you pay many taxes. You pay federal taxes, you pay state, the Estado, and the city taxes. So three different taxes. In California, the taxes are very, very high. Why the majority of poor people live in California? So you pay their life. So when you see a Latino woman with seven children, you get angry because you say, because you say, man, there's my, there's my taxes. And, and you're a Latino woman, but you're a hardworking woman. But then you see, usted, miramos nuestra propia raza, and we just say, oh, man. You know? Okay. And, and that's why people get angry. And por eso que los mismos Latinos votaban por Trump. Yeah. So maybe it's a long story, but once again, I am generalizing. Because, I mean, like, for example, in Estados Unidos... I think Unidos, it's a very complicated uh, problem. Yeah. In Estados Unidos, we are MS. Somos los mareros. Aunque, yes. yeah, yeah. no generalizan. We are MS. Mm -hmm. Oh, sí. Oh, man, los salvatruchos. Los mareros. That's what we represent. Maybe in five years, ya no, pero in this moment, aunque la vean bien vestida y todo, ah, pero you're Salvatorian, so... You know, people tend to generalize. So I think that's the problem. But anyways, um, I, I, the guns, I don't think that's the problem. Let me explain to you what a red flag is. Okay. Um, JJ, imagine you're going to buy a car. Yes? Yes. The car is beautiful. It's a 2021 Toyota Corolla. Yes? But only 2,000 kilometers. Okay. Do you believe that? Excuse me? Do you believe that that car, I'm sorry, the car is dos años tiene el carro, let's say, 2020. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And when you look at the kilometers, it only has 2,000 kilometers. In two years, that car only has driven 2,000 kilometers. Do you think that's normal? Mm. Okay, ese, hmm, that is a red, <laughs> that is a red flag. Um, maybe it was uh, in the machine of the car, have um, move, move. The no, yeah, but, but. But what I'm saying is a red flag is something suspicious. Okay. Something that I makes you know that mm. it's not correct. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. So it, that's a red flag. It's an expression. It's a red flag. Yes. Okay. Yes. Like, for example, girls, imagine you have a, a Marce. This is an example, okay, Marce? I'm not saying because I know that you're single. I'm sorry, I know that you have a boyfriend. But imagine one day your boyfriend 
No, I'm not going to say you. Mejor. Imagine this girl, another girl. This girl, she has a boyfriend. And one day her boyfriend got very, very drunk and he hit her. He hit her. And the next day, the boyfriend, oh, man, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know what I was doing. I was drunk, blah, 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 blah. And you forgive him. Lo perdonas. But then again, this man, when he gets drunk, he's violent. He drinks, he's violent. And he frequently drinks. Yes? Is that a red flag that you should continue with that man? Yes, it's a red flag. Okay, that's a red flag because that's when you stop and think, hmm, aún estoy a tiempo de, you know? Because imagine that man says, uh, you're going to marry that person in a year. Y viendo todo, like he's a violent person. That's a red flag. So you say, hmm, maybe not. Maybe I shouldn't get married. Yes. So in the United States, I think there should exist red flags, maybe from, from teachers. Because if I am a teacher, imagine I am a teacher for high school and every day I saw Carlos come, Carlos, Carlos, Carlos. And one day I see Carlos come dressed as a woman. Okay, there's no problem. Creo que puede hacerlo. But for me, that is a red flag. It's not something very serious, but it's a red flag. So I I should report, I don't know, to el director de la escuela or, but I should report something about Carlos. Why is bad that Carlos dressed like a woman? That's not the bad part. The bad part is that maybe Carlos will receive bullying because now he is openly, you know how children are. Because now Carlos is openly gay, he might receive bullying. And some people take bullying in different ways. Some people fight, some people cry, and some people just kill people. Da, 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 da. So I think the teachers should, should look for red flags. Remember Kindergarten mm -hmm. Cop? Did you watch that movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger? Yes. yes. Remember that little boy que lo golpeaba el papá? Remember Arnold Schwarzenegger? He punched the father. He punched. Okay. I you never seen. I don't remember. I don't remember the teacher. Well, okay. There was. I, a, remember, there was, I remember the move, but. There was the one move. student that he was always late and he always had like. Bruises, moretes in his body. Ah, okay. And uh, Arnold, Arnold Schwarzenegger saw that and he said, hey, that's a red flag. So when that continued, he spoke with the mother and he told the mother, tell him to stop. Okay, imagine that's happening now because that little kid can maybe in the future become crazy and kill other, other children. Yeah. So I think that's, that's where the problem starts. I don't know, but that, that's really crazy what is happening in the United States. But yes, Jacko, you're right. I mean, guns is a problem, yes, because it's easy to get. But I don't think that is the problem. <laughs> because if there are no guns, if a person wants to kill somebody, he will look for different ways. Teacher. Yes. I wrote the an article. It says is more easy in the United States for a teenager to buy a gun than to buy a beer. Yes, it is. Did you ever watch that video? I think it was in 2005, I think. Que está de moda inyectar a las medicinas. Yeah, some stupid people, they just went and then they started injecting veneno to the medicines. Huh? Many people died, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
that's why in this moment I would not like my son to be raised in 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 California and the United States. I prefer him to Finlandia or something. <laughs> yes. All right. Um, so yeah, okay, so good. Some people think it's guns. Some people think it's it's a psychological problem. Yeah. And remember, people work hard in the United States, man. Latinos, Latinos have two jobs. So you never see your children. The people who spend more time with children are the teachers. So I think the teachers. Bueno, creo que los profesores ya pueden llegar chaleco antibalas. <laughs> Can you imagine? Thank you, Steve. Yeah, I, yeah, and I think they have a gun. I don't know. It's, it's too much. Okay, listen, it says here, by the end of this class, participants will learn how non-defined relative clauses as sentence modifiers. I know that if we read this here, non-defining relative clause as a sentence modifier, everybody's like, what? So let's see the video. We're about to finish advanced two, which means you're a step closer to complete your English course. Pay attention to the last topic. Non-defining relative clauses as sentence modifiers. You can use non-defining relative clauses with which to make a comment about an entire sentence. I have three cats, which means there's usually a lot of cat fur on my clothes. My roommate is a slob which is why I want to get my own apartment. Non-defining relative clauses as sentence modifiers. In these relative clauses, the relative pronoun which refers not to a particular noun, but to the whole idea in the main clause. Non-defining relative clauses are always the second clause in a two-clause sentence. Because these clauses are non-defining, they are set off from the main clause by a comma. This type of non-defining relative clause adds information or a comment that applies to the first clause, but it is not essential information. That cannot be used to begin a non-defining relative clause. For example, laptop computers are easy to carry, which is why many people travel with one. People enjoy playing video games, which means new software titles come out all the time. If you notice, these clauses make a comment on the complete sentence as opposed to commenting on just the noun. To finish up, type three sentences using which to make a comment. My roommate is a slob, which is why I want to get my own apartment. Let's do this, which is. <laughs> Okay, imagine who can finish this sentence. Well, let me give you an example. I have five children, which means my house is full of toys. Correct? Yes. I actually, I only have one toy, one child, but the house is full of toys. I can't imagine people that have five children. Mm -hmm. So did you understand that? Which I'm not, Marielos. I'm not talking. Yeah, Marielos, she has six, I think. What happened to Marielos? Her father was sick, remember? I don't remember. Yes. Yes, I remember. Um, so in this case, which is not referring to my son or the toys, it's referring to the idea, to my comment. For example, Irena lives alone, correct? Irena? Yes, teacher. Which means, which means that you can dress how you want in the house. Yes, it is true. <laughs> Good. Which means you can do whatever you want. In yes. 
That's so cool. Nobody, nobody tell me anything. Yes. Jacko, Friday is payday. Oh, imagine on a Friday. What does that yes, mean to San sure. Salvador? No, I, I, I don't. I don't travel to, uh, to San Salvador for the uh, festivities. No, only in Santana. <laughs> no, no, but listen to this. Friday is payday. What does that mean? Friday is payday. Pay, pay you your will, salary. You will earn yes. Money. Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> it's a payday. Yes. That's it. No, no. Listen, class, Friday is payday, which means there will be a lot, a lot of traffic. Yes. Um, and, yes, and that's that's what I'm looking for, class. I mean, come on. And for vacation too, teacher. Oh, yes. yes. It is the last day is vacation. It's for the vacation payday. And I, I am going to have a lot of patience because... In, on the street, it has a lot of traffic. <laughs> yes. I mean, normally Fridays are, there's a lot of traffic. But imagine this Friday is a, pay, is a payday and the last day before vacation. Oh, man, that's a three-hour three hour traffic. And the size maybe will be raining. Oh, God, yes. Yes. <laughs> So, so Friday will be payday, the last day of, of before vacation, and it will rain, which means, which it means be a chaos. it's going to be a chaos. <laughs> yes, in traffic. Traffic a lot. And... Friday is pay is payday, which means Saturday and Sunday. Pizza Hut and Pollo Campero in Metro Centro are going to be packed. <laughs> yeah, Metro yes. Centro, Plaza Mundo, Plaza Mundo a Popa. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't know that what is the obsession with Pollo Campero man? <laughs> and Pizza Hut. And, and Mr. Donna too, teacher. Mr. Donna too, all right. All right, okay. Um, in Santa Ana is Bamban Cafeteria. I remember that name, Bamban. Yes. <laughs> In San Salvador, the unique places alone it, um, is um, La Gran Vía and Multipla. <laughs> no, but those places are full at night. <laughs> Uh, at night, but in the afternoon, in the in the oh yes, uh, morning or evening is a long place. Yes, it's empty. <laughs> yes, it's true. Yeah, but I I I, uh, I prefer Metro Centro and Galerias. Oh my God! <laughs> you know, I like I love Metro Centro because it has everything. It has all the banks. It has the electricity. It has the water bill. Everything. The, you know, in all the stores, but sometimes I don't like the people. <laughs> yeah, but man, if they you... always hit you like boom, boom. You know, like, you know. Yes, but if you have a day with your wife or your friend, it's a perfect place. Plus, a mundo in la Gran Vía. <laughs> yes, it's true. Yeah, because you know, you, you know what I don't like. You know what I don't like. It's like um, when I go to Metro Centro, for example, I go to. ¿Cómo se llama? I don't know, like a cafeteria. Uh, Starbucks. No, no. Uh, Macaulay's what? Santa Duvijas, right? Ah, and, ah. I, and I, I like that combo. The tamales there are very good. You know, they give you one tamal, and pan, and coffee. Can I have one, please? And then when you want to sit, there is no table because people sit there in the consuming in esos locales. They just sit on the table. And I don't think that's respectful because those tables are there 
or the business because ahí está Neveria, Sarita, está, you know, those tables in front are, are for that. Yeah, but but I like I like Metro Centro because it has Dollar City y Gran Dollar. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember, I remember. Gran Vía, you didn't see that. I remember uh, some years ago when you visit, uh, visited in Galerías, you uh, you see you saw a long places but nowadays you visited um galerias is full people for all places ah uh, yes. no it's very ugly i you hate know, and the problem <laughs> the problem with a date if you take a date to metro centro no, if you take una cita, a date to Multiplaza or Gran Vía, you're in trouble, especially in Gran Vía. Yeah, because, because imagine, yes, imagine you take a girl y después de la cine, are you hungry? Do you want something to eat? And your only options are Tucson, <laughs> Benny Gans. Yes. Oh, oh, man. <laughs> but if you go to Metro yeah. Centro, like, are you hungry? And you have chorizo. <laughs> <laughs> or uh, Burger King Econo Combo <laughs> <Yes. laughs> <laughs> yeah all right <laughs> so, yeah so which means okay so so I gave you like three examples already Friday is payday which means there will be traffic y le agregamos más Friday is payday the last day of the month the last day before vacation and it might rain, which okay. means it's going to be a total, total chaos. All right, Maida, give me an example, not necessarily about Friday, but just anything. Okay, well, uh, tomorrow is Friday and many people receive the pay. And it mean many which people means? will buy many things. Okay, good. All right, good. Marce, give an example. Okay, uh, for example, Sarah don't cry, which means that he, she, does, she doesn't have feelings. <laughs> wait, wait, but if Sarah doesn't cry. Uh, Oh, yes, but I don't think right. Sorry. Which means she doesn't have feelings. <laughs> no. only, only with Clarita was for the first time. Only with Clarita. <laughs> oh, no, she didn't no. cry. She didn't cry in that either. All right, Marisa, <laughs> give an example. I am addicted to this thing. Marisa, are you there? Give me an example, please. Okay, Irena, you see, that's the problem when you don't put cameras. So es lo que dice, and so forth. That's why, right. and so yes. forth, no, dice, solo háblenle lo que tienen cámara. Irena, are you there? I don't have camera teacher. No, but I know you're there. I know you're there because <laughs> I heard you participate in the class. Go <laughs> ahead, please. Yeah, I'm here, teacher, but I think when I speak, nobody, or oh, I, I try to speak, but I, I can't continue speaking. Really? Is your microphone okay? Yes, I think it's okay. Okay. That's why I only listen. No, but I I can hear you. You can know. or you can't? No, you can't. I can't hear you. Yeah, we can't hear you. In this moment, it's okay. Well, now we now we are, but I can see when you have mute and you when you don't have mute. I don't think you unmute your your microphone. Maybe that's a problem. Okay, Irena, give me an example. I tried to put it uh, with mute because I have a, a, a little uh, pet. It's a dog. And we when she barks, I tried to put it mute. And yeah. I tried to open the microphone to participate. But I'm not agree with the way of the class because I think we don't participate. Uh, or we, we don't have the same opportunity, everybody. 
I I really hope everybody participates, and I think everybody does participate. But usually, people that always participate, I don't know why, are the people that have cameras. Mm -hmm. Because I always see everybody participating. And sometimes um, what I see is like, it, what I see in my screen is the people that have cameras. And the people that don't have cameras are the last ones. O sea, no, no me pare, es, así está formado el Zoom. <laughs> you know, sometimes I only see like the picture or people that have cameras. Yes. So okay, Irena, give me an example. Huh? So on the camera. Yeah, or, or 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 be active, like Irena. Like sometimes Irena can't can't um she can't, but she's always active. <laughs> so Irena, give, give me an example, please. Okay, let me see. Um I, I am... but no more Friday. G give me another example. <laughs> Okay, for example, um, I have a cat. That means that I have to care every day at night. No, no. Okay, good. I'm confused, teacher. No, 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 that was good. It's okay. No, it's, yes, it's just an idea. Like, for example, um, ¿Cuándo empieza la publicidad navideña? On September. Oh, after, oh. after September, oh. right? Yeah, after yes. September 15th. Okay. okay, so imagine people say, <laughs> oh man, okay people, Independence Day is over, which means that now the Christmas publicity is coming. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's, it's, an, it's an expression, it's, it's not, you know. And then I can say, um, well, after... August vacation, August vacation, mm -hmm. um, it will be faster, faster go to Christmas, is correct. Okay, good. But you see one thing, Irena, don't complicate yourself. Just okay. keep it simple. Okay. For example, hey, Christmas is next, which means the cumbias are going to start <laughs> or the, yeah, or Christmas is coming, which means the the, the light Marco Antonio Solis memes <laughs> are coming. Yes. Ya vi uno que ya sale así. Hey, ya casi. Oh, oh my no. God, man. <laughs> Christmas is begin when the chumpy boy are put in the supermarket. Yes. Okay. Now listen. Yes, it's true. Now listen to this. Who can finish this for me? Uh, okay, Maritza, finish this sentence for me. September is coming, which means um, which means the the file, I, I don't know how to say the file uh, are going to be on the streets. The March, okay, the March, okay. Good. September is coming, which means March is, will be on the street. September is coming, which means you will never eat in Mr. Donut because they are always full. Yes, the promotion. Mm -hmm. The promotions, two for one. Yes, uh, September is coming, which means, etc., etc., etc. By um, Milton, finish this. Tell me. Next year are elections, which means. Which means. It's possible uh, we will be another 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 president. No, no. But remember, what always happens in elections? In election, election. Yes. What what always always happens in elections? Before elections. Ah, oh, the the. Which means uh, the begin uh, propaganda. Yes, the propaganda will begin. It's like, oh man, next next week is elect next year's election, which means all the politicians will be in church 
en el mercado. TV. On TV. Yeah, but they all, they all go to el mercado like normal people, you know. Deme dos coras de tomate. Like, oh my God, they're normal people. Yeah. <laughs> next, ne next year is elections, which means all the promises will come. Yes. When I am Before president, I will do this. <laughs> All right, let me see, let me see. Mr. Jacko. Yes, teacher. You have children, right? Don't you? Yes, I, I had two children. Three. Two. Two. How old are they? Uh, yes. Uh, repeat, please. How old are your children? Uh, I have a, a little girl for eight, eight old, old years. And eight years old? Eight years old. Yes, uh, and uh, a man. Uh, a boy. A boy. <laughs> a boy. Uh, he is uh, 16, 16 years old. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. He's a man. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he's a man. Hey, that's very good. You have an older son and a younger daughter, which means the big brother will protect the little sister. The 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 last Sunday was uh, celebrate uh, my uh, my daughter's bride Friday uh, birthday. Listen. So your son is sixteen years old. Mm. No, my my little girl. Yes, uh, she. It was her birthday. She, yeah, son. Sunday was birthday. No, but but your son is sixteen, correct? Yes, my son is sixteen years old. Okay, so Sirham, okay. Alex, son is sixteen, which means this means that Hako is have a problem. Very present right now. Yes, <laughs> for, you will. For, for many cows. Yes, 16 is a very difficult age for a boy. Yes. Well, he you know, cures, he cures a fir, a fierce. I have a youngest too. Yeah. Fierce years in, in college. He goes um, to the bachillerato, university. Bachillerato. High school. Uh, high school, first years, first uh, years in co yes, in high in school. High school. Okay. Yeah, but remember, when when you're a boy and you're 16, that's your first everything. <laughs> My youngest yes. son your first is... cigarette, your first beer. I'm not saying your son, but you know, general <laughs> boys at that age, <laughs> is is a very difficult age. Yes, it's very difficult. <laughs> You know, your first, maybe your first girlfriend, your first beer, your first um, party, your first date, your first kiss, whatever, you know what I mean? Your first everything. Yeah. Your first everything, yes. <laughs> At that age. Your, your first fight. <laughs> your first fight, yes. I, yes. Have, I have a, a, a young boy for uh, 15 Years oh, too. oh, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, is is that the many many problem because yes, I, I is the the music is like uh, for my music is only 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 like rock. And he likes rock. Yes. Oh, uh, that's good. And, that's good. Yes, and play drums and play guitar, electric guitar. Nice. I like that. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yes, I'm sorry, women, but that's it's it's about you know uh, I I was speaking about man because I am a man and I remember <laughs> I remember 15, 16. It's a very difficult age for a boy. I don't know for a girl, but for a boy, it's very difficult because <laughs> at, we like girls at that age, but girls at that age they like older men. <laughs> 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 I remember that. Yeah. Yes, Irena. Mm, mm, no, no, you were going. You were going to say something. Ah, uh, yes. Um, I will say that um, sometimes uh, women um, 
don't have don't are um, how to say and difficult so difficult at that age. yeah they're not very difficult i think it's uh it's more common for the for the boys yes i don't know why you know you know why you want to know why yeah. Yeah. Right stupidity <laughs> Yeah. No, really? we are we are stupid. We are. I mean, we just do stupid things. We don't think. We just do it. Oh yes, it could be. Yes, that's why. I we have just... two brothers, and they they yeah. gave to my mom headache. Oh yes. <laughs> yeah, me too. I started when I was eleven. The man lived less. <laughs> well, I remember seeing how I told you that my first concert it was Nirvana. Yes, yes. I, wa I was I was your hair and yeah. your nails. No, but I was 13 years old. I was 13, and I escaped from my house because I had to travel one hour for the concert because my mother will never let me go to the concert. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so um, I have a bruise. Tengo una acá. Because I waited for her to sleep and I escaped and I went to the concert. And when I came back, you know, opened the door slowly and my mom, she threw a shoe. Ah, she threw a shoe at me. And I have this scar forever. But yes, but hey, it was worth it. <laughs> but imagine at 13, at 13. Yes. And I, I would kill my son if he does that to me. <laughs> you have to be prepared. Yes, I will be prepared. <laughs> that, that's why that's why I was telling Jacko, oh man, 16, 15, 16, and 17. This is very it's a very ugly age. <laughs> I remember all in this moment. <laughs> oh yes, it was fun. I did I did so many things I don't regret. Yeah. <laughs> but it was better because we didn't have Facebook, WhatsApp, nothing. We just, so nobody controlled me, you know. <laughs> Mama, voy a estar en mi amigo estudiando. Okay, son. <laughs> hmm. All right. Uh, let me see. Mayra, are you there? I'm here, teacher. Hello, Mayra. Hello, teacher. By my house, there's a lot of thunder in this moment. There's a lot of hmm? thunder and lightning. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, okay. What does that mean? Uh, it will, it will be. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to say. Uh, it will be, no, it will rain. Yes, exactly. So by my house, there's a lot of thunder and lightning, which means it will rain. Yes. Do you know, yeah. class, do you know that myth about the thunder and lightning so you can calculate the rain? No, no, wait. No, 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 seven it depends. It depends. no, but do you know how to calculate the rain? No. I promise no. you, I don't know why, but it works. I'm going to teach you. Okay. This is this is like remember when you were little and people told you if you point at a rainbow, it disappears. Mm. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm. Yes, your parents or somebody never told, don't point at the rainbow because when you point, it disappears. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's this myth. When first, what is first, lightning or thunder? Uh, lightning. Lightning. Okay. Lightning. So lightning. When, when, okay, do this and remember me and I promise you will see it's it's crazy, but it's true. Because this is the speed of light. So when you see lightning, like if I see lightning right now, I count seconds. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. You hear the thunder. So I heard the thunder at nine seconds. That means it will rain in nine minutes. Really? Yes, yes I promise. It's scary, but it works. Oh, I didn't know that. Yes, my I wife didn't know. believe me. Like, I, I, I listen <laughs> similar too. Um, you, you. Yes, uh, for example, when the thunder is is uh, uh, nine nine. Nine second and the next eight second and the next seven second uh, is the is the the rain is is uh, uh, back rápido. It's coming, yes. It's no, coming but do up. that. Watch if if tonight. I don't know if it's gonna rain tonight or not. But next time when you see lightning, count count the seconds. Sometimes it's three, four seconds. Sometimes it's twenty seconds. But you always hear the thunder. And that is the distance of the rain coming. Okay. I I I scare I scare the light and the thun and the thunder. Oh my! I don't <laughs> believe you. <laughs> yeah, I hate. You did not cry in Bambi, and you were scared of lightning and thunder. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> yeah. Oh my! <laughs> no, I'm joking. I remember one day when um. I have a storm. I I walk for my I walk I walk in my house and suddenly and I I listen I listen um a uh, thunder and I run <laughs> I I run for all my house and I <laughs> and I. <laughs> and I fell down I in my my in my bed. <laughs> oh man, Marce, did you hear that? She does have feelings. <laughs> yeah, she does. She, ha she has feelings. <laughs> no, yeah, I remember my husband. What happened? <laughs> oh my God! No. Do do I, you, class? Your do you do you have? Can't believe. Are you scared of anything or do you have phobias? Yes. <laughs> yes. You have phobias? All the people have. Yes. I have a very, very stupid phobia. Have you heard of tripophobia? Mm, this is for the holes. On yes, the I have that. And it's so ugly, man. It's like, oh, oh. Really? Yes. I, I, it's, it's a very, I, I I'm sorry I'm sorry for the vocabulary, but it's a very stupid phobia. I don't know why. <laughs> like today, I saw que carro es. I think it's a Dodge, but it's a big truck. Que el grill de enfrente is a lot of holes. It's like oh, <laughs> that's ugly. My another uh, my another scare is when. When I turn off of the light in my house, and my husband work at Rayer, and when when he went to his job, I I turn on I turn I turn off a uh, two light in my house. Oh man. Look, class. Uh, look at look at this. I'm 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 not looking, but this is tripophobia. Do you see my screen? Yes. Why? Why? Oh my God! I can't no. see that. No, no, no. Ew. Yeah. Some people. Well, hold on. Let me cover. Okay, I'm not seeing. But you see my screen, right? Yes. Yes. Is, is really? No. I mean, some people say, "Oh, that's ugly." I I get. I I freeze, Miguel. Oh, like like right now, I I am. It's tripophobia. That's ugly. Do you have Do you have a phobia similar? No. Mm, no. Do you know there's a phobia of chickens? Yes, for the hider. One time, 
one time I was with my son in Catedral because I like to take him to feed the, the little doves, the birds. And um, there was this young man, he was maybe 11, but he was crying, Mama, vamos, no, no quiero estar aquí. And the mother was angry, like, don't be ridiculous. And, and I told her, look, maybe, maybe he has phobia. And the mother was, como eso no existe? Yes, I promise you that that does exist. Maybe he has phobias to birds and chickens. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it sounds funny, but it's true. Do you have phobias? But listen, there's a difference between scared and phobia. Scared is that you don't like it. Like, oh, it's ugly, but, but lo soportan. Phobia is like, no. Maybe I have phobia for the snakes. Oh, okay. I don't like, I am Do afraid from, from that animal. Okay. I have phobia the right. what? The cucarachas. Yes. <laughs> oh, I have a friend. He has arachnophobia. He has phobia to spiders. But really, I did something very bad one day because I didn't know how serious his phobia was. I thought it was. So one time I bought a little a little spider, a toy. <laughs> you know, it was a very ugly spider. And I put it in his desk. Mm -hmm. And I say, hey, Dabura, that's his name, El apellido Dabura. Hey, Dabura, um, give me a pen, please. And he, yeah. And when, when he opened the desk and he saw it, se quedó. Oh. Like, oh. Y me quedó. Oh my God, it's true. <laughs> yeah, I did something similar, teacher, a uh, long time ago. I have a, a co-worker. Yes. That it, it was a lady and she, she had phobias for the uh, ara arañas, the spiders. A arachnophobia. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. And then I, I, I put the... Uh, I don't, I don't find, no, I didn't find uh, an, a spider and I bought, um, how say, mosca? A fly. Uh -huh, a fly, but big, like, uh, like the spiders from the, the ule. Yeah, and a I, rubber, rubber. A rubber. And I, and I left on, on her desk and I went to my office and my office was, um, three office from, from her. And, and I start work and I just heard a, a shout. <laughs> and my boss was very angry at me and told me, yes, I you were. And I say, no, I didn't. <laughs> no, it wasn't me. But she was a very uh, increases. Crisis. Yes. yes, it's true, people. When someone tells you they have phobia, don't don't do that to them. Casi la mato. <laughs> yeah, a mí me mandan en WhatsApp acá rato cosas así. Es. I oh. block, I block, and I tell them, if you send me that, I will block you. I'm sorry, but I, I don't like that. Yes. Well, you know, and I didn't know, I didn't know that tripophobia is a very big phobia because... And I discovered the name of this phobia maybe five years ago. But I remember I always had that phobia. And I think it was once because I saw a dog. One time I saw a dog in the street and the dog had many holes. Con gusano saliendo. With Thank holes. you. Yeah. And after that, I remember that so much. And maybe after that, I had phobia. I had um, tripophobia. And um, so I never understood, but sometimes I was driving and something was uncomfortable or like maybe somebody was wearing a shirt. I said, camisa. I, but I, I couldn't understand why. Mm. Intel, beautiful internet. <laughs> I discovered 
Ah, si te llama tripofobia. Oh, okay. Teacher. Um, yes. One time uh, I I was in inside the elevator for 20 minutes because oh. the electric electric light fires and then is a hard moment. Mm -hmm. uh, the outside out, out the people uh, say many comments mm -hmm. about different comments and then when you are inside oh you you put very 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 nervous you get very nervous yes yes is is so did you become after that did you become claustrophobic Yes, after that, uh, after that, I I don't use elevator in in whatever place I <laughs> don't use only the outer work only the outer outer. Do you park in underground? Like if you go to galerias, do you park under? Yes. Yeah, like subterráneos, parqueos subterráneos, underground parkings. <laughs> do you like them? Yeah, yeah. Um, yes, I use. I use normally. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, that happens. So you don't use elevators anymore. <laughs> Imagine those elevators like in, in New York with those buildings, the Empire State <laughs> Building. Wow. You have to go like 70 floors. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. <laughs> wow. Imagine that. <clears throat> okay, class, then I will see you tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is Thursday, which means... That is the last class. The last it's the last, last class. class. It's a free day for us. It's a Friday, yes. <laughs> Tomorrow is our little Friday. Yeah. <laughs> All right, class. Then thank you very much. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you. Tomorrow. Teacher. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Thank you. Good night. Good night. See you. Good night.